Uh, my name is Ahmad Dostawi. My name is Adam Molini Berry. I'm Abdulaziz C. I'm Natalie Miller. My name is Debbie So. Project manager for CCTIC Dakar. I'm from ICE Alex. The growth coordinator for the wonderful Impact Hub Network. The manager of the ICE Hubs Global Network. And I'm head of partnerships at Impact Hub Islington. Impact Hub felt it was important to join together with Afro Labs and ICE to co host this workshop since a repeated um, and continual conversation point um, in this ecosystem is about hub sustainability. Essentially there are um, a large number of spaces globally that support all sorts of interesting content, but there's a problem in terms of whether these spaces can actually survive and fund their own activities. So we're trying to figure out what's working and so they can continue to do the work that they do. We're basically bringing the strongest innovation space practitioners together to co-create a body of knowledge that will help other innovation spaces become much stronger and more financially viable. We had a lot of applicants, we really took our time screening them. They know what they're doing and they're here to contribute knowledge. Because we know how important hubs and labs are for the ecosystem and that they're struggling often with survival and with income generation. So Hub in a Box is harvesting all the great revenue models so that other hubs that are maybe not so far on the maturity line and becoming self-sustaining get there faster and better. Providing services to socially oriented startups is, is, a, is not a very profitable business. It requires us to be innovative and find other sources of income to make things work. Each one of us as hub builder are facing a lot of problems. So the only way to do it is to see who are the people who are facing the same challenges and then thinking all together of how these challenges could be tackled the best and the fastest way to do it and how to generate revenue streams in order to be self-sustainable and for our hubs to be sustainable as well. These businesses are here to support other startups that are going to be changing the world and making a positive impact. So actually the financial sustainability of our growth directly impacts those businesses around us and it's really important that we practice what we preach and we run a sustainable enterprises ourselves. So we want to create a platform where it's easy for every hub around the world to get to know what are the key success stories. Why are they working so well? Why is that hub so flourishing? And we need to gather all of that together in one place, which is then easy accessible for everyone. And that has never happened before. The main output of this will be a wiki, uh, which the open movement is helping us put together. And the idea is that, you know, as the wiki is populated, you can go on, you can find inspirational, revenue generating models that will help you become more financially viable as a space. We're actually defining the topics, the subcategories, the way it's going to be organized and we have a developer live in the room with us who's translating this all online. It's really to the point and helps other hubs to run their business more financially sustainable. Like, it's like how can we increase our impact by re generating more revenues and more income? You win by coming together as a community and creating more. And hub sustainability wouldn't work if it weren't three networks coming together with people from all over to solve a common challenge. So what we want to put in the box are solutions that could be useful to different types of hubs so that someone who's building a hub can say, oh, you know, this person, this guy or gal solved this challenge and now I'm going to go talk to him and figure out how I'm going to solve it in my own case. If we're suffering through similar challenges and we're not sharing uh, the solutions, then why are we here in the first place? So this is just creating the space, um, the time and the opportunity for people who want to help out others. Participants that are here this time are ambassadors that are going to basically take Hub in a Box and the open movement back to their countries and to really encourage the local hubs to use these models to become financially viable and then for them to feed back this information because they all had to have different perspectives, trying out different things. And already the first day, people were like, oh, that's an amazing idea. I need to implement that in my uh, business models. Not only have I downloaded a lot of stuff uh, for our own hub, but I've also shared a lot uh, that has been beneficial for the other people present. I really enjoyed the whole process. It was really great to understand more about the work of every hub and understand which kind of things I can try to implement in my space. Meeting a lot of really cool people and new spaces and hubs that I didn't know about and uh, building relationships with these people and I'm most likely gonna collaborate with one or two of them in the near future. It was really entertaining uh, and really enjoyable. Uh, learned a lot, obviously, you know, lots of, lots of ideas. Uh, my brain had been buzzing all around, but uh, you know, it, it, was, uh, it was really nice. I had, I had a great time here.
you bring your challenges to the table. Financial sustainability is a huge one, and you know how are we going to keep doing the work that we're doing? So now I have so many ideas, I have to do them. Invitation is open to everyone to collaborate and work together for a better world. Ordinary people can create extraordinary impact together. And now with Hub in a Box, we have the tools, we have the knowledge, we have the know-how and the know-who, and we're gonna give all information just to anyone. This is gonna be open source. So follow us in Hub in a Box and we'll keep in touch.